Hey guys, so today I'm doing my um, April um, favorites. I know it's a little late, it's like almost June, but I've just been super stressed with school and everything, you know, graduating, all that kind of things. So, and uh, moving, obviously, is like the number one thing. So I haven't had time to, to film anything. And I know my, my last video was like back in December when I did my uh, birthday outfits. Um, but ever since then, I've just been slammed and everything. So, um, so my next, you know, I miss you guys so much. I'm just talking to you about, you know, beauty products, uh, you know, clothing, just everything. So um, let's just get right into the video because I have, you know, a good amount of products. So I just want to, you know, you know, talk about them all. So the first product I'm actually wearing it right now is probably when my face is so like glowing and really nice is the L'Oreal True Match Lumi Foundation. Now this foundation I discovered just at the very end of April so it barely made it into my favorites but um, I figured it it's a good match because you know it was still in April so um, I got the one of the darker shades. Now it doesn't even say like the thing on here. It, it, like it doesn't even say the uh, color on here, but it has um, SPF 20, which is really nice. So I don't need to put it on here like so, like sunscreen now that it's summer. But I got the darker shade b because it is you know like summertime now and um, I'm tanning. So um, yeah, it just, it just matches my skin really well, and it does really get like as you can tell. Well, I have like highlighter and everything on, but. As you can tell, it just gives your face a really, like, and, um, it just gives me, like, a really, like, luminous finish. And it's not dewy. Um, it, like, may look dewy, but when you feel your face, like, your face is just really soft. Like, it's not, you know, um, it's not dewy. Like, it looks dewy, but it's not. So, it's just, it's luminous is the term for that. So, that's one of my favorites. Um... Another one is, um, I've, I've had this for a really long time, but I kind of stopped using it a bit because I got into the, um, Maybelline, like the Dream Bouncy Mousse blushes or whatever they're called. And I kind of put this in the back of my makeup and then I brought it out. I actually kind of forgot about it, but it's the Sugar Bomb, Sugar Bomb Blush by Benefit. And it has the four color combinations and uh, I'm wearing it today oh my gosh my face is so like bright um but anyway and I'm wearing it today and it, just, it, it really just does give your face that extra boost of color maybe a little bit of highlight because I believe it's this bottom one here this brownie one here I'll kind of swatch it for you like it does give you know that like luminescent look so I, I kind of mixed that one with the coral orange here, but I do like mix them all together somehow. But together, you know, they just give the most beautiful color. I and mean, you can't really tell. Well, I guess you can. It's like right there. But yeah, that's all my like highlighting. But yeah, this is a beautiful product. So I love that. And I got that a little while ago. Maybe about, actually about a year ago. So, you know, I've had it, but I kind of just forgot about it. Um, so another one is the Super Stay 24 Hour Color. And this is in one of the pink shades. And I also love this. Um, just because it's very... Um, like, I have another one. I only have two. This one and then a red one. Which you guys see, I think. I've talked about in my other videos. But I like this one because... Again, it's not like as dark as my uh, red one. Obviously, it's pink. But um, it just gives a really, you know, like, light, nice finish to... You know, maybe like a really you know, like, dark eye and, like, really, you know, like, contoured face and cheeks and everything. It just gives a very natural, nice tone when I wear this. So, um, I really like this, and what I, what I like about it is that, like, when you apply, because, you know, this color is supposed to last, it's supposed to last all day, and then I only have to, you know, apply this, it's like the balm, um, about three or four times a day. It depends on what I'm doing. Um, but yeah, it just gives a very nice, um, you know, just a nice finish to the uh, to the mouth. Um, the next product I'm actually wearing it right now on my nails is this gold color right here, and it's by Sally Hansen, and it is called. I don't know if you can guys like read that, but yeah, you can read it. Um, but it's the hardest nails, the Extreme Wear collection, and and again, I just picked this up at the very end of um 
of April, so it barely made it as well, but I, you know, this, and it's also a metallic, and I bought four others, but this one was absolutely my favorite out of the whole ones that I bought. Actually, I'm wearing all the colors I bought on my nails, so this is a pink, and again, they were all metallics that I bought, and then the gold, the blue, and then the purple, and I'm just wearing the gold again on my thumb. So, but yeah, this is a very nice, you know, summer colors, and they're, and they're all metallic, which I like because, you know, metallic is, you know, kind of the thing for summer I find in my collections and stuff. So it's that nail polish, and then this lipstick, and again, I've had it, like, a, for, over, like for over a year now, um, but it's by NYX. It's the Diamond Shine uh, lipstick, and uh, I still have, you know, a lot left. And, uh, but again, this just goes really well, again, with, you know, like, natural lips and stuff. But, um, it's, the, the Diamond Shine, uh, collection from NYX will always be my favorite for lip glosses and everything. Just because it's that, you know, thing you can wear, you know, every day, but it's not too much shine, if you, if that makes sense. But, you know, it's, like, not too much shine, it's not too matte, it's just that perfect amount of shine that, you know, with a lip gloss over top, it's really, really pretty. Just, like, a clear lip gloss, it's very pretty. Um, now the next two products are both mascaras, again, these just came in at the very end of April. So this one is the new one by L'Oreal, it's the Telescopic Extensions, and, um, even though it is in my favorites video, it's not my favorite mascara I've ever used, but in, in April, it is the favorite one I have used, like, in April. Um, and then the second one is the Colossal Volume Express as well, but... I've had this one in the past, but the only, like, I don't like the smell. It's a funny, like, like mascara has smells, but I don't like this one at all. It smells really funny. Um, but the telescopic, I love, especially for length. Like, I'll use it first, I'll curl my lashes, then I'll use the volume to give me, you know, the extra oomph, because I, I, I kind of switched up my routine, actually, this morning. I did this one first, I curled them. Then I did the telescopic. I do not like the way my lashes came out today. Like, well, this one turned out okay, but not really this one. But anyway, um, I just, I did not like the way it turned out at all. Um, so I'm just going back to my other routine. This one first curl, and then this one. Because this one, you know, gives that volume afterwards. So I like that combination. But overall, I mean, these are good mascaras. I don't think I'll ever be repurchasing this one again. But maybe definitely this one. Um... My favorite mascara of all time is the Scandalize. Like it's like that, like the biggest brush you can ever buy in mascara. It's by Rimmel London, I believe. But yeah, that is my favorite mascara of all time. I don't know why I just didn't buy that one instead of this one. But this one is still a great product for volume. So I like those two. And another product, and again, um, I've had this for a really long time as well. But I just kind of started using it again in April. That's why it's like half like gone. It's the Maybelline Eye Studio. One of their palettes. And this one is in... It doesn't even say. Okay, well, whatever. Anyway. It is kind of like the natural palette. It's got the white with like the one color. And then the darker for the crease and everything. And the combination I love doing is this one for the um, lid color here. The second one's like gone. And then my um, like it's... This color reminds me of like of a Burberry color. That's why I really like doing it. But I actually did the Burberry color on my lids today. Um, my makeup looks so bad. Sorry guys, but I just got my eyebrows done, so that's why like half of it's gone. But anyway, um, I did the dark color in the crease or in the lid, and then the gray color in the crease. But it's really like it's great in here. But when you apply it, it's like a brown. Like I don't understand. Like here, I'll swatch it for you. Like. Like, that's what like look like. It's, it's like brown. Hmm. Anyway, odd. Well, very good palette. Um, I'll probably be buying another one. Maybe ones that all have like dark Burberry colors. I don't know, because I'm kind of into that dark eye, even though it's summer. It's weird. And the last thing is, this is probably my favorite product of everything I've showed so far, is a candle. Now, this is called Boathouse Row. It's by Bath and Body Works. And, um, okay. Now this scent, if you have a boyfriend, it smells like their cologne. Like, I swear to God, like, it smells so good. Um, like, 
when I see like the title, I'm like, oh, it's probably, you know, some like, you know, summery scent, you know, like you're lying on a boat or it smells like, you know, like fresh air because it's like boathouse. But then I smelt it and I'm like, oh my God. Like I put it, like I threw it in my bag. Like I didn't even think about it, you know, because like sometimes you smell and you're like, can I imagine that in my house or my room or something? And you're like, no, maybe not. Or like, yeah, maybe. But this scent was like a death, like I didn't even have to think about it. I just threw it in there. Um, and then I told my boyfriend about it and he just, he, he, he had to laugh, of course. But yeah, the scent is really, really nice for, like I've been burning in, in my room like every single day. That's, and I just bought this. No. Oh. Um, yeah, but like that's like all my room smells like right now. It's like a man. And I freaking love it. Love men. Um, but yeah, so those are all my, um, April favorites. Um, you know, like I love, um, doing these kind of videos because, you know, they're just so much fun and you get to see what other, you know, girls have for their products and like what their favorites are. You know, some of them are, you know very constant and the same with me you know maybe like some of the girls might like you know candles in their videos and everything like that but yeah so those are my um april favorites so um like this video and i'll leave a video response or you know comments on your favorite products of the month or i'll tag you in it and you guys can um you know do your april favorites of course mine's probably like the last video to about four eight um april favorites but yes those are that so please subscribe and i'll talk to you guys later